So this happens to me quite a lot. I'm hungry, I buy a croissant, I put it in a plastic bag, I pay for it, and I remove it from the plastic bag to eat it. Both the croissant and the plastic bag serve their purpose, but the croissant is gone, and the plastic bag will still be around for a few centuries. I used it for about 15 seconds. If I throw it away, the plastic bag can either end up on a landfill, it can be burned with all the other trash, or it can be blown away into the water and return to me in the fish I eat 25 years from now. It takes at least 450 years for one plastic bottle to decompose. So if you accidentally lose your empty bottle in the woods, you can still pick it up in the year 2400. However, most petroleum plastic does not biodegrade. It just fragments into tiny microplastics, not visible to the naked eye. So, on the upside, you can't break your teeth on this kind of plastic. This is me doing grocery shopping. It's almost impossible to buy anything that is not wrapped in plastic. As a result, we throw away a lot of plastic packaging. 140 million tons a year to be precise. Most of it ends up as landfill. A smaller percentage gets burned. And only a really tiny part gets recycled. What happens with the other third? We know the images of birds with plastic in their stomach. We have become accustomed to the idea that even on the remotest of all islands, this one, where nobody lives, the beaches look like this. If I tell you that every minute we throw one garbage truck full of plastic stuff in the ocean, you won't be surprised. How about recycling? If we would recycle all our plastic, you would think we would end up with a cleaner planet, right? But, according to this study, our use of plastic will be four times higher by 2050. So, even if we recycle everything we use, it won't be enough. We would still have to produce a lot more plastic. More importantly, new plastic is cheaper than recycled plastic. That means that, even if you are a model citizen who recycles their plastic, most companies won't even use it. Producing this much plastic is plain dumb. Surely we can think of packaging that is reusable, refillable, or just not plastic. We are human beings. We invented helicopters, iris scans, and Tetris. We can surely invent our way out of this, 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 and this. When you buy your takeaway coffee, you can bring your own thermos. You don't need a bottle around your shampoo. And you can bring your own bags to the supermarket. But we won't get there easily. Not with recycling alone. Not with cleaning up alone. It's time to stop using plastic and invent a 